wanted to get something straight with you guys. For those of you who believe in Yahweh, Elohim, Jehovah, Allah, the Abrahamic God, I must ultimately say a few things. Do not tell me that I must pray to your God, that I must bow down, that I must reject my logic and my reasoning just so I can believe, because faith is all you need. Faith is gullibility, the denial of observation and the denial of reality. Faith is nothing. If you had proof, if you had evidence, you wouldn't need faith. Do not tell me to bow down. Do not tell me to pray. Do not tell me to let go of my logic because his ways are higher. Because let me get something straight for you guys. Your God is omniscient, meaning he's all-knowing. Your God is omnipotent, meaning he is all-powerful. Your God is omnipresent, meaning he's everywhere. So, why do you have to say he has to use faith as evidence when that's clearly not evidence, that's just gullibility? Let's forget about the whole fact that he's omniscient and he's all-powerful, which means that he knew exactly what happened to Adam and Eve before he even created them and he could have easily stopped it and prevented it all, but let it happen anyway. Your God is omniscient, meaning he knows all. Why do you tell me that I must pray to him and he must come to me? Well, I must come to him. He knows what's in my heart. He knows what's in my brain. He knows exactly how I think. He knows exactly what I've done, what is in my brain, and what will happen in my life, and what exactly what I'll be thinking of in the future. He can prove to me his existence right here and right now, but he doesn't. Why? If he doesn't want me to bone in hell forever, why doesn't he prove to me he exists? If he doesn't want no one to bone in hell, why doesn't he prove the knowledge to everybody in the universe from when he first created everyone? I'll tell you why. Either A, he's a prick, or B, he doesn't exist. Think about it. Ignorance is bliss. 